Good morning. It's Jean. I'm just going to do a quick yard sale haul. This is from last week and this week. I've been trying to do this twice, and the lighting was terrible. Uh, the first things I'm sure you see are the words love, live, laugh, and over here is blessings, if you can see it. Those were just $3 a piece. Then we got the little ladder for a dollar. Got the sad iron was a dollar. Got the tub for a dollar. Got the old books on the ladder for 25 cents a piece. And there's even an old gardening book there. Some of the books were the late 1800s, some were early 19. Then I believe the gardening book was like 1950s. Got this darling little silver Easter egg. That was a dollar. Over here, these are two Royal Dalton uh, vintage plates. I got those, I mean platters. I got those for two dollars a piece and they are in such wonderful shape. They're absolutely gorgeous. And I can't remember if I, the tub was, it was one of the purchases this week. And then the little sad iron, that was a dollar. There's a great old vintage. Um, the lady told me that was an Appalachia egg basket. I don't know whether it is or not, but I just thought it was neat. And I did pay $10 for it, and it was full of pine cones. Back there is a wrought iron wreath. And I mean, that thing is heavy, but I thought I'd use that outside somewhere. And whether I keep it that color or paint it, I haven't decided yet. Here's a cute little Santa Coca-Cola tray. That was a dollar. Back here, I got four P. Buckley Moss prints for $25 each. And if anybody here has collected those, you know how expensive just the framing and matting is. They need a few touch-ups and they haven't been cleaned yet, but I'll get to that shortly. There's the one with the horse and carriage and the old brick house. This is a members only print with a snowman. Another snow scene from the church with Christmas tree. And another snow scene with the sleigh, horse and sleigh. I think the colors on them are just beautiful. And like I say, they need a few little touch ups. Uh, they've been in the basement for a while, the lady told us, but for that price, I'm happy to do it. Then right here is a lovely old sampler. Got that for a dollar, and it's in that old crossbuck frame, which the frame itself is a great value. Then I got these cobalt bottles. Uh, they're all old ones. They're milk of magnesia. I think all of them were milk of magnesia, and they were four for five dollars. Then got this great old bed tray that has a place in the ends like to put a book or a magazine and it was in great shape uh, for something that old. Got that for a dollar. Then got these two old needlepoint stools. They were only two dollars a piece and they definitely have some age on them and I, I love the one with the burgundy top. Then got this primitive uh, picture of a girl. The guy called her the creepy girl. He said he would hate to come down a hall and be facing her. But the frame is absolutely wonderful old frame. So uh, got that for five dollars. Then right here got a little toll tray for three dollars. Like I said, nothing's been cleaned up yet. It's just like we bought it. And then there is a wrought iron architectural piece. That was two dollars. Then got this beautiful lamp. It has a dragonfly and the leaves coming up so that this looks like a flower and that was ten dollars. Got this old antique table for three dollars and John did clean that up already because that was last week's purchase. Well this is all of our purchases for the last couple weeks. I hope you all had a great time yard selling this week and I hope you had some great luck. Stay cool today because it's going to be hot all week again. Till the next time.